Hey family, welcome back to Lightworks. I hope that you are blessed and well. If you're new here, welcome. Thank you for being here. If you are returning, hey soul family, what's going on? I hope that you are well. I hope that you are loving on yourself. And I hope that you are celebrating the small wins. Even though it sometimes doesn't look like we have accomplished anything, that we've overcome much. Day by day, we are progressing, and the divine is wanting us to acknowledge those small wins. So what I'm picking up on the energy of today, somebody has really alchemized a difficult and dark situation. And although at first you didn't understand why you were going through what you went through you are now seeing why you had to go through it you're now seeing how beautifully you went through it and the divine is now want, wanting you to acknowledge that and celebrate that okay because whoever you are you just kept it moving um, it was difficult to get through this situation you did the best that you could and the divine is saying you really got through that in a beautiful and very um, the word is grace that they're giving me gracefully okay it was a beautiful way for somebody to ascend while enduring whatever this is that you went through okay this is gonna maybe a very emotional read they guided me to seeing beautiful again okay so there is something here that the divine wants to share with you related to your story or this message most high god divine holy spirit we thank you we love you ancestors of the highest white light please come in and connect with me now i do not allow any darker energies or anyone that is not of the highest white light to be here you must leave Archangel Michael, please protect our energy. Please close the door on anything that's not of the highest white light. And encamp the angels of protection around myself and the collective at this time. Please and thank you. What is the message, Holy Spirit? What is the most important message for our loved one? Okay. This is a letter. It says, friend, I'm not sure who else needs this assurance today, but I sure do. We don't have to be fearful about what the future holds. God is already standing in every one of our tomorrows, standing there with his protection, waiting on us with his wisdom, going before us with his hope and his provision. God is not shaken by what he sees in our tomorrow and neither should you be he's preparing you today with all that you need to handle both the ups and downs that await you learn his lessons well today and you'll be fully prepared for tomorrow there are good things ahead really good because a really good god is there with his arms wide open with love please don't forget this today Okay, I feel as though this letter, while it's beautiful and helpful to us, this is the energy that whoever I'm picking up on, you are being this guide to others. You are being this friend to others. You are letting everyone know that you have been through something, but you have this knowing this positive outlook that the divine is there the divine will be there two weeks from now when we experience something that we may not have been able to get through before okay the spiritual awakening this is you letting us know letting other people know that it's gonna be okay you too will be able to get through whatever is coming this is beautiful. <laughs> I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Okay. 
there's something significant about a place. They wanted me to get a card that best describes this situation. Holy Spirit, what is the message? Temple, look at this. Is this my card? Yes. Okay, thank you, Holy Spirit. And grassland behind that. They're saying this is the one, though. <sighs> There's so much here. It says spiritual practices, meditation and reflection, spiritual guidance. Okay, that knowing. This is being tapped in and understanding. Yes, there are surely things that are going to come. But we're going to be able to get through this thing with ease. If we stay connected, we stay grounded, okay? Wow, beautiful. Also, body, body, mind, and spirit. Thank you, Holy Spirit. The temple. Body, mind, and spirit. My nose is itching. This is beautiful. Oh, my goodness. Healer of the ages in abundance, okay? Wherever you are, you are a healer. You're helping people to see the abundance of love, of support, of resources, of everything around us that will help us to stand our ground as we endure whatever life brings about. Beautiful, beautiful energy. Yeah, because we know the Decepticons are out here, but we are able to stand our ground because we're doing the work. Holy Spirit, what is the message? Door to Spirit. <laughs> temple, path, temple. Mm -mm -mm. Speak Holy Spirit. Mm, 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 mm. Transformation. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Okay. <laughs> They're showing me so much here. This is us entering through this door to spirit into this temple on our temple path, transforming the way that we see things understanding why like i said before we started we had to go through things understanding that when we walk through that door the divine is with us no matter what's on the other side no matter who's trying to bind us tie us up restrict us okay this is beautiful what else holy spirit solitude okay Hermit energy, material harvest. <laughs> the universe. Hope, okay? Woo, speak Holy Spirit. Bottom of the deck, we have the angel of love. This is your energy, overall energy. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. <clears throat> They're guiding me to take this out, okay? And then beneath that strategy, this is the entire message. This is talking about how you got through what you got through, how you see things now that you've gotten through whatever this was that you endured, okay? How you know you had hope you stay in a loving energy, okay? You knew that the, the divine, the universe, was with you. This is really, really beautiful. Okay, this thinking man wanted to show itself with his anxiety energy. I feel like there's a lot of outside projections as always. This type of energy that wants to see us down and fearful. B 
be proud of yourself, whoever you are. I'm telling you, somebody here was in hermit, okay? Loneliness energy, solitude energy, okay? Somebody was praying about it, healing about it, putting your feet in the grass about it, meditating about it, and connecting with the divine. <laughs> okay? Seriously, wow. What's the door to spirit? Good news. I feel like this is what, <laughs> look at this stubbornness here. I feel like you came out of this stubbornness energy, walked through this door to spirit and started to understand things started to realize how you were going to get through this temple path how you were going to transform understanding that the divine and your spirit guys were always there with you like the book was saying they're going before you okay and this was good news this is how you were able to get through whatever you went through when you did not no longer when you stopped Leaning on your own understanding. What's the temple path, Holy Spirit? Yeah, when you came out of this pride energy. What's the temple path, Holy Spirit? Mask. Loneliness. I feel like the temple path is this. Moving away from. A lot of energies isolating going within okay going down this narrow path that not many go down okay taking off your very own mask okay this I'm saying that to say being all of these other people when you strip down to just you your soul okay you are able to get on this path and now you're in this transformation energy. What's transformation, Holy Spirit? Family, spirit guides. <laughs> Seeing how much they love you, that they're always uh, with you, surrounding you, protecting you, guiding you, okay? What else for transformation? strategy again this really sparked your movement on how you were going to navigate through this and when you got that when you realize okay spirit guides are showing me i need to go this way i need to go that way i need to retreat from these people i need to uh, start doing these spiritual practices more often meditating connecting okay this took you right to this energy of love and i'm talking about while you're going through whoever i'm picking up on you went through a lot of hell okay it didn't look this pretty at first but when you walk through that door and you strip down and you let your ego die ego death energy and you let them guide you and make the moves for you, you found who you truly are in the midst of the chaos, in the midst of the destruction and whatever was going on around you. So beautiful, so beautiful. <laughs> oh my goodness. Eternal love, this is who you are, this is what you represent, this is what you show to others, this is what you're showing others now. Wow. What's Angel of Love? <laughs> Collaboration. I'm talking, I'm whoever I'm picking up on, look at this. I knew it. I felt it. Sweetheart energy. This is you. Okay. You are showing others how to connect with their higher self. How to work with your higher self. How to work with the divine your spirit, guys. How to tap in energetically 
okay? Because when you're in solitude, okay, this is not about physical people around you. This is engaging with those around you to let them know that they too can go in hermit energy and connect and tap in, okay? And look at this person is this fertility energy. You're teaching people how to, through self-love, create something beautiful. I love it. What solitude, Holy Spirit? <laughs> Speak, Holy Spirit. Yes. Okay. You are showing people how to go within, love themselves, and begin to produce and create something that will bring about monetary gain, okay? Abundance, material harvest, okay? And co-creating with the universe to do this. Mm -hmm. You're bringing a lot of hope to people. You're shining a light on people, okay? Nine, nine could be significant here. Nine, nine. We got four, four here. You could be seeing those numbers. Three, three. A lot of repeating numbers out here. Confirmation. All right. What is material harvest, Holy Spirit? Material harvest. Too many. Material harvest. What's material harvest? Live and learn. I feel like you have done the work in Hermit understanding about the law of attraction about how to co-create with the divine with the universe to produce okay and somebody is earning while they sleep okay <laughs> period what else there's more on this material harvest i feel an adverse energy somebody is also in your energy plotting trying to learn about your what you're doing how you're receiving finances somebody is trying to let's see what is this I'm picking up on material harvest Holy Spirit what is this energy yes yeah, somebody that's wants to stop your finances somebody that's in this stubborn energy somebody that doesn't want to hear about how well you're doing how much is going on for you ancestors are showing up what's going on with this person holy spirit there's a strong opposition energy here Okay, somebody that wants to bring in bad luck for you or someone that gets a lot of bad luck and someone that's been stubborn. We have stubbornness here with withdrawal. We saw the ancestors. The ancestors have nudged this person to move on. Okay, and they don't want to withdraw. So I feel like the universe is stepping in. Okay. What's universe? Why is you, what's going on here? The universe is stopping this person or these people, whoever this is, that's trying to extract finances, inquiring about your finances. Why is the universe here? Okay. Somebody's upset about your perseverance. Okay. The universe is observing this person. What's fury, Holy Spirit? Yeah, this person does not want you to get to the top of this mountain. They know that you're on the spiritual journey, this path, okay? Adventure in the reverse. They do not want you to be able to manifest 
okay, to be able to co-create with the universe. They're upset about it. What else for universe, Holy Spirit? Look at this, triumph, okay? You're winning, you're co-creating with the universe and they're protesting. What else is new? Show me the positive side of this universe energy, fate, okay? Idea, you're destined to create some beautiful, brilliant idea with the universe, okay? I went right back to fate. It's written. Show me what the universe, what's universe, Holy Spirit, bully in reverse. Whoever this person is, is not, they're going to be sorry, okay, for getting involved. What else for universe, Holy Spirit? There's a lie. Yeah, this person is going to be sorry for getting involved. What else for universe? Introvert <laughs> blessings, okay? Introvert, solitude, self-love, okay? Blessings, okay? Can't make this stuff up. The universe is working with you. you. You're not alone, although it appears that you're alone. Introvert energy, the universe, we're clarifying universe. Blessings, okay? Beautiful. What's hope, Holy Spirit? Compromise. This is you working with your spirit guides. What else for hope? No hesitation, no reservation, okay? You believe, you know, okay? Idea, you know, the light bulb went off, okay? You are aware. You've seen the evidence of what can happen when you trust, when you have that knowing that God is there, that God is going before you, okay? When you know, when you see the evidence of opposition and you understand that it doesn't matter because you are partnered with the divine and you are going to get through it because it is written, it is fated for you. Okay, this is such beautiful energy. And this takes you to a place, okay? This takes you, where, where does it take you, Holy Spirit? Okay, this car fell over and we have balance here. This takes you to a place of balance, of peace, of harmony. <laughs> I can't make this up. Okay, where you can rest. Look at this, because this is destined. You are protected, Archangel Michael in the building, okay? And prosperity is yours. <laughs> Fulfillment of wishes because you are a wise soul, okay? Speak, Holy Spirit. What is this place energy? I'm being guided back to this deck. It's taking you to a place, okay? You've learned the lessons. You've gone to school, okay? You allow the divine flow, river energy. You allow the divine to guide you. Where is this place that our loved ones are being taken, Holy Spirit? Workspace, okay? This is energy of service, of you getting to work. Working with the divine, working with the universe, okay? Stepping into your divine purpose. What's workspace, Holy Spirit? We have bathroom in the reverse. <laughs> okay. This is the energy of not taking no stuff is what I'm hearing. This is ancestor energy, bathroom in the reverse. You're not taking no stuff, okay, if you get it, no ish, okay? You are about that life, okay? Tavern, what is this? Tavern. This is opposition, opposition energy. They're showing me something. What is this, Holy Spirit? What is this tavern energy? Karma. 
for bad, making the wrong choices, somebody that's in opposition, trying to strategize against you and the universe. Somebody that thinks they're strong enough to box with God. All along, even in this, you are in this angel of love energy with all of these people are investing against you. This is, look at this, against you. Wow. Very powerful energy. Whoever you are, very powerful energy. This folks was trying to tie you up. Trying to put the work in on you. What's tavern, Holy Spirit? I do not like this energy. Again, people that are investing in bringing you to a place of lack and hurting you, okay? Strategizing, strategy up here. Bottom of the deck, action against you, okay? What's the outcome, Holy Spirit? The rod of correction? The creator of all things having the control. The universe having the control. Nothing these people do will prosper. You are partnered with the divine. What they going to do about it? Anything else we need to know, Holy Spirit? <laughs> You're still over here. Knight of Cups energy bringing love. <laughs> Offering love because you are love the empress showing up here angel of love i love it i love it i love it i love it what else holy spirit strong strong powerful and what's the outcome for our empress our loved one holy spirit what's the outcome for our loved one <laughs> happiness illumination freedom okay leaping because you know the divine has you i love 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 this energy this is beautiful 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 what else holy spirit let's get a guardian angel message you are an angel, whoever you are. You are so poised, relaxed, okay, with that deep knowing that God's got you. And you are letting others know that God's got them too. Those that are, yes, look at you, intuition on point, that deep knowing. Ooh, that one shout out. Healing. Ah, we just love this. Listen to your heart. Love is the greatest healer. Okay, this is you. This is the energy that you exhibit. This is what you're putting out. You, okay? Love is the greatest healer. It has the capacity to balance and heal your emotions, thoughts, and perceptions, which in turn will heal you physically. Your angels are here with you and will help dissolve your fears. Trust in the power of love to guide you and your life will magically transform transformation. This card is confirmation that healing is occurring right now, okay? Beautiful. Let's get one more. Okay, that one wanted to shoot out too. Prayer. Dear guardian angel, help me to be flexible in my attitudes and beliefs. Help me not to fear the transient nature of life. Help me to remember the eternal light which emanates from my soul and the eternal light which emanates from the heart of every living thing. Help me to remember that I am eternally guided and loved by God and all creation. This is so beautiful. I absolutely adore your energy, loved one, whoever you are, whoever this is resonating with. You should be very proud of yourself. You should be celebrating yourself. The small wins, you are destined just to be 
in a blessed and relaxed state because of the beautiful energy that you pour out into the world okay the divine is so proud of you i love you so much you are destined to be in this happy energy okay have a beautiful day uh i don't even want to clear this energy it's so beautiful even with all the opposition that's there it's just like it just doesn't matter okay you already know it's there so what okay they're not going to be able to stop anything they're only uh, just adding to their own karmic debt, okay? While you continue to operate from this place of place of peace and love, okay? Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. If you are in need of a meditation, check the Lightworks goodie bag on the way out in the description box. If you feel inclined to donate or if you need a personal reading, my information is in the description box for that as well. You are all greatly appreciated and loved. Peace and blessings. Ashe.